and then different ways of how you can decorate it. So come on in, if you're feeling spooky, you're in the right place. What you need for this lantern is some willow, some tissue paper, a brush, some glue, scissors, masking tape and cling foam. So that's all you need to make this and then a few extra pieces then for decorating but I'll show you that in the later stage when we have this together. So first off I'm going to show you how to put the base together which is this. These sticks are cut and these are 12 inch and these are 15 inch. Now what we want to do first is to join these together in a triangle like this. Now at some stage if you want to um, have your lantern on a stick. You can put a wee bit of wire or wool around there so that it, you can go out and spook like that. Now this next bit is we are going to wrap this with cling foam and just wrap this around the structure. Next part then is putting on the tissue paper. So easiest way and probably least messy way for the tissue paper is what I've been doing is getting the PVA. If you have a baking tray or a plate or something, um, just paint PVA and then put your tissue paper on it and keep painting it. So this is grand, I'm getting messy doing this as well. Take that off then. It's all got loads of lovely PVA on it. Smooth it on. So it's going to be a wee bit messy. Okay, so here is the lantern when it is finished and covered with the PVA, the cling foam and PVA, and it's covered the whole way, the three sides and the bottom. So the bottom of it's done as well. So I'm going to show you now just a couple of simple ways um, to decorate it. So what we're going to do is we're going to do pumpkins. Um, so I have cut out, out of some coloured tissue paper and cut out like a pumpkin shape. This is still wet so we'll just place this on. Um, there's still some PVA here as well so I'll just put this on. And then I'm just going to just place that on. If you can do anything that this one here has got some has the moon on it and a few crows. You could do bats, bats would look great on it. But we'll go with a pumpkin because this is where the the jack o' lantern, the tradition of the jack o' lantern came from. Um so here we go. So this is another piece and just put that on there. So you can see how, how it all comes together. The PVA dries clear as well, so you're not going to lose any colour or anything. So that's one way to decorate it with, um, with tissue paper. Another way to decorate it as well, as you can see from this one here, it's some leaves that's on it. So that's a nice kind of autumnal touch for it. So what we have done is I've got some leaves here. So these are ferns. Because that gives like a nice kind of skeleton effect. Now if you can't get your hands on the lantern kit, 
And another great thing that you can do is jam jars. What we've done is taken the jam jar, again, painting it with the PVA. Um, so here's one that has already started. These, I'm doing this with um, pieces of tissue paper cut into triangles, just long, kind of. So that you can cut them into um, like flame shapes. your candle or your little light and it and that is you so here is another idea that you can do with the jam jars just cover them in colored tissue paper and then make the faces out of darker tissue paper and make those spooky little jack o jam jar lantern Whoa. So the final piece of putting your lantern together, so we've put it together and we've decorated it, is cutting a wee slice in the back just to get your battery operated light on. So I just take a knife and just slice a wee flap there and lift that through so then we can pop our light in. And there you go, that is your lantern. Now as the darkness of wonder approaches, uh, I hope we can all help each other to shine a wee bit of light and each other's lives and take care of each other. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this lantern making workshop. I enjoyed it. Uh, I'd like to thank Leah as well from Leah's Life for uh, helping me do video and edit and put this all together. I hope you have a great Halloween and I hope you enjoy the lantern making workshop. Thank you. Bye.